What's up guys, if you want cheap, fast, reliable AMT, make sure to hit up my sponsor and use code BUGS for 5% off checkout. Links down below in the description. Hit them up right now. What's good YouTube? It's your boy BUGS back on another NBA 2K21 My Team video. And guys, today, we're gonna go over some stone stuff, man. We're gonna get into the market. We're gonna get into this. We're gonna get into that. How to make MT. If you guys are new, man, smash that sub button, drop the like. It'd be greatly appreciated, man. All time domination games, they are such a drag, guys. Once you do get these all time domination done, guys, get away. Don't do historic. Do not do the other one. It's not worth it. It is just such a grind. You get tokens, blah, blah, blah. It's so freaking boring okay single tto is probably the way to go right now all time dom probably one of the best ways to make mt honestly not mt mostly like tokens mt whatever you want to say and you get two free diamonds but the grind guys is miserable not only is all time domination so boring it is so hard like you have to sweat so you also have to have a good team to get a whole time domination done just letting you guys know but without further ado man let's get into some market man today is just a day you need to sell your cards asap why because amethysts are 60k and this simply just proves that not a lot of people either have the game and or playing the game right now and if i were you every single amethyst 20 you do have would probably be recommend selling they have absolutely no value so if I were you, try to sell that man. They're just not valuable whatsoever in any way, shape, or form. These cards, not good. They're just not. They're just really just not good cards. They don't even have gold badges. As you can see, my boy Giannis Antetokounmpo MVP going for 58,950 coins. This card, guys, is obviously good because he's Giannis, but he's not good. He's, he's, he's just good. He's not like insane. This card's okay. He's got silver badges and bronze badges, okay? He has no three-point shot. Yes, it's Giannis. Don't get me wrong. He's It's Giannis. But let me say one thing. This is probably your best out of this card you're going to get in the game. That's why I have him. I have him for all-time domination. That is the only reason why. This is the squad I have right now. Realistically, I have a lot more MT than this. We'll sh I'll show you when I have more MT. But... For the squad, as of right now, man, it's nothing special. This is the squad. It's nothing special. This is the squad you should have. It's not expensive. It's not cheap. It's just decent. And most of my... These are reward cards, man. Most of these rubies you see are like reward cards, I guess. No, no, I never mind. All the reward cards are trash. But anyways, let's get into some methods. So I heard the ruby filter has been going crazy. Ruby and Sapphire has been very easy to snipe. So honestly, today, what I want you guys to do is 110% just sell your cards. Please, just get rid of them. Please, I beg. I beg. Just, there's literally no point of you actually holding on to any of these cards. There is no value in any of them. So what I want you guys to do is Friday, we're going to get new content. Whether it's going to be good, whether it's going to be bad, that's not the point. The point is... That we're going to get new content. You know what that means? That means a market crash is coming to the game. So to like actually like get you guys educated on the game, get you guys a little smarter. What happens when there's a market crash every single time during the beginning stages of the game? This is what happens. So, okay. Friday they drop packs, right? Amethyst 20s drop. Other cards drop. What else do you do? What do you do with Amethyst 20s? All that, blah, blah, blah. You invest in every single amethyst in the game. Same with diamonds. Whatever you get your hands on, invest. I would say stay away from rubies. But since amethysts are so, so low, I mean so high right now, they're most likely going to drop, I would say, like 10 to 20k less. So now, what you guys are going to want to do, depending on what packs they do drop, they're probably going to be pretty juiced, pretty, pretty good packs. What you guys are going to want to do they're gonna drop in value a lot this is what i did last year and i know it works this year because it already worked this year um pretty much when the new packs drop what you guys are going to want to do 
You want to buy out every single Amethyst 20 you guys see. So, for instance, man, when this game first came out, the Amethysts were going for around 23k. Giannis was always the expensive one. Same with LeBron. Kevin Durant was like 24k. Hardens were 23k. I can see that Kevin Durant's the Hardens are dropping the butt. The LeBrons, the ADs, and Giannis, obviously, are very expensive. So now, what are you going to do when that content drops? How are you going to make the most MT? You're simply, just simply, you're just going to sell your cards, okay? You're going to sell every single one of your cards on Thursday, Wednesday, or today, whatever. Thursday or Wednesday. Today is Wednesday. So you're going to want to make sure you sell your cards. And then not only are you going to sell your cards, you're going to buy back every single bit of MT on Friday. You're going to build yourself a nice squad. You're going to play with it for a couple days. And then Saturday, Sunday, Monday, you're going to resell. Why? That is the way life goes. That is the way you make the most MT, I promise you, every single time. So if you don't follow me, you don't know my methods, that is the best method in the game. Buy and sell. It is the easiest thing to do. I'm telling you, man. That's how you're going to make MT. But anyways, man. Right now, some filters. We got the Amethyst filter set at 20,000 MT. Don't even waste your time. It's going to be way too hard to snipe anything. Like, seriously? It's going to be way too hard. It, it's just... It's just too hard. It's way too hard to snipe right now, man. I'm just going to say this. Grind whatever you can. Try TTO. Try Unlimited. Limited. Whatever you guys want to do. Right now, these game modes, I mean, these filters are just way too high. That's it. It's just... That's all I have to say. Like... I don't know. That's how I feel. Honestly, that's really how I feel. These filters, way... Oh, that's just night. I missed it. I don't know. Ruby filters decent. Sapphire filters decent. Realistically, I'm just gonna say stick to my method. Buying and selling every week. You're gonna make the most MT possible with that method. If you have like 100k, you're gonna make probably turn it into like 150, 200k as long as you're patient. It's a very easy method. It requires no effort. It literally just requires going into Bug's channel, see what he says, and that's literally it. And why is there freaking a million Kyle Lowry's for 1400 MT? That is so sus. Wait, and why? Look, and the auction's also broken on top of that. But anyways, guys, other than that, I hope you guys did enjoy. Right now, do whatever you want on the market. It's kind of dead. Just make sure to sell your cards. That's really all I have to say. Also, some other tips. We're actually going to have you as an insane MT making method later. But yeah, that's really all we got. Hope you guys did enjoy. Stay tuned for more content. Have a good one. Peace.